you might be having us almost every night for four and a half months from October. Can you tell? <music> Welcome back. How are you all? We're okay. We're all right. Been busy painting. Yes, we've just come out of the hot tub. <laughs> it's so busy. That's cost us for for a twenty four hours ten pound in electric to have that flipping thing going. Honestly, but it's a little treat, and uh, it's all about treats, isn't it? Always have a treat. Have Get a you treat through life. Day off. And always have a holiday booked because it always had a little bit of sparkle. Now, as you can see, those tans are gone. Yeah, all gone, not It's all washed off. Yes, your belly's still brown. Is it? I'm not going to show you that. I'm not going to show me that. We'll no. have to put it as X-rated if we do that. Well, welcome to our little cottage. Look at that. This is all the work that Mark has done. And I've told him to do it. <laughs> We've got a fire going in the back here. It's making a noise. I'm going to turn it off. No! It's nice. No, it's no. making a noise. Oh, it's spoiling my effect. Anyway. Yeah, that's better. You can hear us now. <laughs> I think they can hear us anyway. Now then, what's this vlog about? By the way, the clock stopped. That stopped about a year ago. We've yeah, we put it. another battery in. It still don't work. So. No. So, what are we vlogging about today? Well, this is a budget vlog, and I know how much you love a budget vlog. Why have we done a budget vlog? Giving you a little bit of an idea of how lifestyle works six months off for six months. And also it shows you how it can be done. Um, considering that the average two week holiday in August probably costs about £2,000, doesn't it? Yeah, but it? that's a family normally, isn't it? Yeah, but, no, yeah. but it, it's still... It's still about two grand, yeah. Plus, probably but, just for two now. I mean, yeah. I dread to think how much Plus spending money, all that San Miguel money. So if you just like being a little bit nosy and you want to know how we do it then stay tuned because at the end of this vlog we also may be going to a new destination in October. Yes. Just had a little thought, I was scrolling through the phone as you do and, and then this idea just pinged as they do. I told Mark, hoping that he would say, now you don't be greedy, you're going on enough holidays, but what did you say? No, go for it. You said book it. Book okay, it, yeah. If it was a bargain then book it. it. Well, it isn't yet because I've booked it, but we're, 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 anyway, we'll tell you what we're going to do. We're doing a comparison of last year, which it seems ridiculous. It only seems like five minutes ago um, when we did the Canary Bounce. Um, this is a total cost now. Uh, we've tallied it all up. Um, gives you a rough idea of what we spent and what we're spending this year. As you know, we did France last year. We haven't included that in the costing, um, but it was a, a six days out of our 90 days that we used. Um, we would average that about 500 pounds, um, plus spending money, plus, plus the ferry. We drove there, remember, we car camped, and we went via Gracelands as well, visited the family. So that's still a cost that we obviously had included in our, our little adventure. But for the purpose of this, we're not going to include that. We're just going to include the Canary Bounce. So the grand total we spent on accommodation was £3,824. Now that was 12 weeks because remember we used a week in France. Uh, the flights and the ferry across to Fuerteventura were £520. So our total spend for the Canary Bounce was £4,344 plus France too, which probably takes it up to about 4,300. Sorry, 4,300. The <laughs> plus France, that takes it to 4,844 pounds. So that's a total of your 90 days, which works out in just under 13 weeks. Now this year, mm. as you know, we've got a bargain deal with Cyprus. So we are paying for three weeks in Cyprus with flights and accommodation we're staying in Pataris near to the beach near to the McDonald's there if any of you know it for a grand total of 639 pounds I mean wow that was too good not to book I know it is out of season so whether everything's open we'll no see. it won't be open I've told you that all oh, right there's no bars open Mark what you'll have to go to the supermarket and check oh, well. on the balcony you're going after Cyprus Mark can you remember or did you just turn up for the flight don't you we are going to Lanzarote we are where are we staying? Well, 
creatures of habit and because you really like it, don't you? Yeah. And he has to get a little bit of a say in it every now and again, don't you? I'll have a say. You have? You don't have it very often, Not do very you? often, no. Because you don't get a chance. We love the owners there. They're absolutely lovely. And they've given us a discount. You see, that's what happens. If you book through one of these... Um, Booking.com. Yes. Are they called search engines? Yeah. Comparisons. If like you get to know the owners... Um, Sometimes they'll they'll do a discount because obviously they they have to pay to go on these uh, booking dot com, but if you look after their apartment, um, sometimes they'll do it a little bit cheaper, and that's what's happened. We had a lovely email from them to say thank you very much for looking after our apartment, keeping it clean, which I did, and uh, being very respectful. Just make you wonder what some people do to the apartments, mm. doesn't it? So they've offered us a, a lovely discount, so we're glad about mm, that. We're going to Tenerife. We are, because it's somebody's birthday in January. My birthday. And we do have a little bit of a party. Yes, we've got a bit of a gathering. Sorting out. Um, so if you are in Los Cristianos on January the 16th, God help ya! <laughs> so we are there for six weeks in Tenerife. We are staying in Costa Adeki. So we bought that in November. And when you look now... Um, you can't get anything for that amount of time for about 2,800, which is shocking. So my advice to you is get your accommodation booked as soon as you can. Even if it's a year in advance, just do it. Remember, it's always better to leave your flights until the very last moment. Uh, well, not the very last moment, but you can book your Towards flights the end. late, but book your accommodation early. Um, and that is what we do. And also, if I book somewhere and then I find it on Agoda or Hotels.com cheaper... Well, I just cancel it and rebook somewhere else. And I've done that a few times now. Yeah, and yeah. saved £100 yeah. in the process. Or if you've got to move your dates because your flight's not available, just move your dates. It's easy. It's easy. Now, we don't always do booking.com. Something that Kev Scotsman said, that he had two phones up and same hotel, different phones, different price. And it's true. And that got me looking. And that's where I saved £100 on the same apartment. We are also going to Atlantis Los Lomas, which is a very, very popular um, apartment destination in Puerto del Carmen. We are staying there twice, six nights for £240. And then just before Christmas, it's a little bit more, 167 for three nights. You've got to expect that at that Over time. Over the Christmas bit. period, yeah. I know that's popular for a lot of you, so we will be doing vlogs there. Um, and that's the last place we stay before we come home in March. So I'm really looking forward to that. It's got good reviews and there's happy. I'll add on to that, that after Tenerife, we are going to Lanzarote again. And we are flying Binta. We're, we're going internal. So we're going to show you an internal flight as well, a crossover to Lanzarote. And it was seventy nine ninety nine for two of us yes. to fly a clock cross in February. So I don't know if we can fun. vlog the flight because uh, travel on, Mr. Dave. Hello, Dave. <laughs> you won't be able to film the internal flight uh, because of the cabin and all that for some reason. You can only film out the window. So I could film you the propellers. <laughs> God. And the rucksack will have the uh, parachute strapped to our back. <laughs> So, Apparently it's a bit bumpy, so we'll see. So, when we go back to Lanzarote, where are we staying, Mark? We're staying at Red. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> um, again, they've given us a discount, so we're very happy with that. And you really like it. I love it. It's just the sun lounger issue. There aren't any. So I have to buy a five-year-old Well, the position in town is brilliant. Yeah. It's, it's central to everything. So we're looking forward to that. So you want to know the cost of that, don't you? Well, and hold on to the end because we might be going somewhere in October. You never know with us. So remember, this is now including Cyprus. So we have extra weeks. So a grand total of 16 weeks. Accommodation is £4,544, and that's for 16 weeks, bouncing about, including Cyprus. Our flights, a grand total of 439 However, we haven't booked the Tenerife flight, um, so we could add another £200 on that, hopefully. Um, I'm monitoring the flights. Best time to book is between May and just before June. We did notice last year the flights went up massively, in June. The best time to book was mid-May. I'm monitoring the flights now. The flight from Bristol started off at 162. It's now dropped. It did drop last week to 141 and I think it's 120 now. So it is dropping. But what it will do, it will dip and then 
if it'll it peak. it will go back up in June mm. and then it will probably dip again. I don't like to leave it that long, to be honest with you. I like to know where I'm going, when I'm going and who I'm going with. Um, we've just ordered new flight bags because... Our ones were destroyed. They were rubbish. Five cities. I'll put a picture up now. I won't name the name of the bags. But Five cities. <laughs> uh, I thought it was board light. Oh, board light. Oh, they're rubbish. Don't buy them. Um, they've all come apart, the zips. I can't have bag anxiety. So we've ordered some Cabin Max bags. They're suede. $24.99 each off of Amazon. Um, they look a lot stronger. <laughs> They do. So we've ordered those, they're coming. We've ordered EasyJet size because we're trying to just fly EasyJet. We don't want to do Ryanair again. Purely because you've got to pay for the seats on EasyJet, they will always try and put you together. So that saves you 30 quid. So it does. It and the hand luggage is bigger. Remember, we only do hand luggage. We'll also be vlogging. Uh, somebody's asked how we pack everything into our little rucksack. And that will be nearer the time when I start packing. We will show you how we do it. What do you mean? You haven't packed already? No. <laughs> That's unusual. Yeah, no. well I have. It's all ready to go. I just don't know what I'm doing. You want to read the grand total? Can you see it there, Mark? I can't see the grand total now. <sighs> there. Oh, there it is. Oh, £5,183. And that is for 16 weeks with accommodation and your flights, we hope. Allowing £200 for the Tenerife flight, which I'm still trying to book. I can go on the 1st of January, £62 each from Gatwick. But we don't really want to lose the day, do no, we? No, we don't. So we're going to hold out, see what we can get. How about that then? What do you reckon? We try and budget as well for €50 Euros a day. So we do spend quite a lot, don't we? We do. Sometimes but don't we, we go deserve on... it? Sometimes we... we go over that budget. Sometimes we go out for a meal and it comes to nearly €50. Euros. But the next day we go shopping and we'll eat in. Well, we try. We did come back with some money last time. We, 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 we actually about, do, don't we? We had about £160 left, yes. didn't we? Yes. Yes, I yeah. spent that as soon as we came back. I well, need <laughs> So it can be done. It really, really can. And take out the cost of gas, electric, heating, because obviously we don't work through the summer. Winter, winter. Winter. It's a no-brainer, isn't it, really? Well, we enjoy it anyway. Maybe you do it. Maybe you're retired. You do it all the time. But uh, we're quite happy to be semi-retired at the moment. We are. At this young age. <laughs> now then, we are thinking of going to turkey yes in october it's not part of the shagan neither is cyprus this is why we can do it so we're looking to have 18 weeks away <laughs> so we've looked on travel republic two weeks in uh we'd like to go to um Fetier, uh region because it's close to dalaman airport um Ola Dene, we absolutely love that and love you've got family there yes hello to louise lynn and mike um, they are my family from my previous marriage, my husband's family, and they're still family. They've been my family since I was 18. They, Louise lives over there. Um, we're going to be vlogging that. We are going to be monitoring it. Do we do a package? Do we do last minute? Probably, because we don't want to book anything yet, because we want to just see how the funds are going, how we're saving. We are looking at that region, looking on Travel Republic, because I've scanned them all. And the cheapest one I can find, or the best value, I shouldn't say cheap, is um, in Hisseroni, um, which is just up the hill, I believe, from Olodene, according to Auntie Lou. And um, they look lovely, don't they? It's all very mountainous. I can get there for 722 flying from Bristol for two weeks, self-catering. When I do it separately, I can get it for 661. If I can get two weeks in Turkey, 500 quid self-catering, Oh, fully inclusive for a little bit more. Actually, mm. no, that's dangerous, isn't it, with you? No. <laughs> we're going to do that. We'll keep you informed. My arm is really aching now, so we're going to say goodbye. We're going back in the hot tub later, aren't we, Mark? We are. And, uh, yeah, life's about having fun, isn't it? Hope you're all okay. Have a fantastic summer. We'll try and get back to you in May at some point. We are hoping the campsite is going to be absolutely rammed. We're going to earn lots and lots of money and have lots and lots of fun. Well, we know we're going to do that anyway. So don't forget, if you fancy camping at Kenningstone, come down and say hello. Yes. And we'll see you soon. We'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.